Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. Setting up a CI slash CD pipeline for a Python Flask application on AWS ECS using Docker, GitLab, and AWS services involves several steps. Here is a tutorial to guide you through the process. 1. Setting up the Python Flask application. Create a simple Python Flask application with a basic API endpoint. Initialize a Git repository for your application and push it to GitLab. 2. Creating a Docker image. Write a Docker file to package your Flask application into a Docker image. Build the Docker image locally and test it. 3. Setting up an AWS ECS cluster. Create an ECS cluster on the AWS Management Console. Define a task definition for your Flask application, specifying the Docker image and necessary configurations. 4. Configuring AWS CLI. Install and configure the AWS CLI on your local machine. Set up IAM roles and permissions to allow ECS to deploy your application. 5. Creating a CI slash CD pipeline on GitLab. Set up a .gitlab CI.yml file in your GitLab repository to define the CI slash CD pipeline stages. Configure the pipeline to build the Docker image, push it to a container registry like AWS ECR, and deploy it to ECS. 6. Deploying the application. Trigger the CI slash CD pipeline on GitLab to build and deploy your Flask application to AWS ECS. Monitor the deployment status on the AWS Management Console. Here's an example of a .gitlab CI.yml file for your GitLab repository. Remember to replace placeholders with your actual AWS account ID, repository names, ECS cluster slash service names, and access keys. This pipeline configuration builds the Docker image, pushes it to ECR, and triggers a new deployment on ECS. By following this tutorial and example code, you can set up a CI slash CD pipeline for deploying your Python Flask application to AWS ECS using GitLab.